Hello YouTube! This is the Future Age channel bringing you today something a little bit different. Now I know my channel has been quite inactive for quite a while, haven't put any new videos up for a long time, but I thought today I'd do something uh, just a little bit different. I thought today I would do an anime slash video game slash manga collection video for y'all. Now, you're probably all looking at this and saying, gee, that's a lot of anime. And you'd be right. This took probably about eight years to collect all this stuff here. So then, why don't we get a little bit closer look at this collection. Pardon me while I try not to trip over all this. As I've said before, this took me around eight years to collect all of this. Now I will say this much, I have not watched everything in my collection as of yet. There are still a few titles here I have yet to actually pop into my Blu-ray player and see how it is. However, if anyone wants any of my personal reviews on any of these, I am more than welcome to give you my take on the series or movies. Okay, so now let's move on to uh, something I ought to get a little bit closer view on. A couple of these I've actually gotten signed by some of the voice actors and actresses. Um, here I got uh, Wendy Lee to sign my uh, Lucky Star collection and also the second season of Melancholy of Haruhi Suzumiya. And now, continuing on, we will now look at my Vocaloid merchandise collection. Now, many of you are probably wondering, well, originally I said only anime slash video game slash manga. Well, as many of you probably already know, Vocaloid is considered part of anime nowadays, so I thought, oh, what the heck, I will include this as well. So, let's get a closer look at some of this stuff, shall we? Up next, we have just a small portion of my uh, video game collection. Uh, I thought since I'm doing uh, anime slash video game slash manga, I'd leave um, only games that are related somewhat to the anime genre. So let's take a closer look here. Ah, uh, Blaze Blue has a fun, fun game. Can't wait for the Chrono Phantasma release here in the States. Uh, and uh, Project Cross Zone. Now that in itself is a very interesting game. Uh, honestly never thought I'd come uh, stateside. But once it did, I just had to pick it up. Uh, and Mugen Souls. You know, that game... Uh, I still had quite a bit of work to do on this game before uh, the sequel, Mugen Souls Z, comes out. Which I will most likely be picking up. 
Uh, and probably one of my um, more recent favorite um, game series, the Hyperdimension Neptunia series. Um, got the limited edition of Victory here. And um, if you give me just a second, I just want to zoom in here. Um, so I got the voice actresses of Nepgear and Uni to uh, give me an autograph for uh, on the uh, instruction manual for the game. Didn't have the limited edition or I would have had them s probably sign um, part of that. But I was lucky enough to get their autographs here. Um, certainly a, a big thank you to um, any and all um, voice actors and actresses that um, did autograph sessions. Last but not least, let's end this with some of my manga collection. Now, as you can see, I have a lot of the Higurashi manga. Uh, missing one of the uh, festival accompanying arc volumes. Gonna have to pick that up at some point. Uh, and also the Umineko mangas. I hope that these um, keep um, being released here stateside so that I can add them to my collection here. Also, I have a few side manga and books there. Uh, but, anyways, I really do enjoy um, the mystery genre. And with that, I guess I will end this video. Stay cool, YouTube. And please, if you haven't already, uh, check my other videos on my channel. And subscribe if you um, like what I got. Leave comments. Let me know what you think of this. And if anyone wants any further reviews on any of this material, I will be glad to do it at some point.